Am I sweating? Oh my god. Hold on. Hold on. I can't see. I'm going blind. I'm blacking out. What is going on? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title below, today we are taste testing Cheetos mac and cheese cheesy flavor, jalapeno flavor, and hot Cheeto flavor. I am so excited to do this video because I've seen this on the market for the past one or two weeks and I've seen a couple of videos of other YouTubers doing this taste test as well. So I'm super excited to see what this will taste like. But before we get started, remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. If you guys like me, give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you guys want to see next in the comments below. Let your friends know, let your grandma know, let everybody and their mamas know. Without further ado, let's go ahead and taste the mac and cheese. I am so excited to taste these mac and cheese Cheetos. And the crazy thing is, this brand is actually Cheetos brand, the chip brand itself. And these boxes, guess how much these were? I'll wait. 96 cents for this entire box. Crazy. So they have three different flavors. They have the cheesy, the Cheetos mac and cheese, bold and cheesy. And they also have the jalapeno Cheetos cheesy flavor, which I do like this. Um, this flavored chip as well is really good. And they also have hot Cheeto mac and cheese. I prepared these according to the instruction in the back. You cook the pasta for about six minutes and then you take it out, put two tablespoons in a pot, including one fourth cup of milk. And then you melt all of that up, you throw the pasta in there and voila. I do wanna say that I didn't add all of the pasta into the seasoning because I just feel like with all mac and cheese, if there's too much pasta, the flavor is not as bold. So I did take out a bit of pasta for each serving. So it does, this portion does look smaller than normal. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and stop talking and go ahead and try this because I'm so excited. So this one is the Cheetos Cheesy Mac and Cheese Bold. This is the mac and cheese, bold and cheesy. My mom actually helped me prepare this and she said that this one was pretty good. Mm-hmm. That one's pretty good. I think I did a good job eyeballing how much pasta that I wanted to incorporate into the seasoning because it does taste pretty good. I feel like if I put all of the pasta in there, this would have been bland. So if you guys do end up making this, I would recommend only half of the pasta and this much of a portion is pretty good. So I'm gonna keep that on the side over here. This one is the jalapeno cheese, mac and cheese. This one has a little bit of the green jalapeno flakes in it. This one's mildly spicy. It tastes pretty good. You know what's really good about this? The fact that this doesn't taste like artificial jalapeno, it's pretty good. Mm. 
I think I like that one more than this one. This is really good. Let me go ahead and rate these because I forgot I got into the zone I'm gonna give this one an 8.5 actually you know what I like this more than normal I'm gonna give this one a 9 out of 10 the cheese jalapeno mac and cheese a 9 out of 10 this one's pretty good guys it's up there for sure let me go ahead and try this So I thought I was going to like that one more than all of these, but because I do like Hot Cheetos, but it's more of, um, am I sweating? Oh my God. Hold on. Hold on. I can't see. I'm going blind. I'm blacking out. What is going on? Wow. This is actually pretty spicy. So if you guys like spice, this is definitely a spice macaroni and cheese. This one doesn't taste as cheesy in my opinion. It tastes pretty good, but it's not as cheesy. I'm going to give this one a... 7 out of 10. I'm going to give this Hot Cheeto Mac and Cheese 7 out of 10. I definitely prefer the first two over this one, even though I really, really like Hot Cheetos. Let me go ahead and try this one again. I feel like I have mac and cheese on my lips, um, so I'm sorry if I do. <laughs> Don't mind me, I was just going in on these mac and cheese. I'm going to give the first two spots to the jalapeno and the cheese, the cheesy bowl of cheese, and I'm going to give the hot Cheeto flavor last place. Although it is still pretty good, I'm going to have to give it to both of these. The crazy thing about these doesn't taste, it doesn't taste like Velveeta cheese at all. It has its own type of flavor that you can't really recognize. So the cheese does not taste like Velveeta cheese. This is actually pretty good. Props up to Cheetos for coming out with these mac and cheese because you guys know we have been fiending for this for the longest. I know they've been watching our YouTube videos, seeing us put hot puffs and Cheeto dust on our mac and cheese and all this crazy stuff. So shout out to Cheetos for doing this. We we love to see it. Also, they do come in a smaller individual cup, so you can make it in the microwave as well. Those are also 96 cents, but why get that when you can get this whole box for 96 cents? I am super full. If you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye!